on all sides from the point of Saginaw and Washington streets in beautiful downtown Durant, Michigan, First Congregational Church presents Cafe Devo, a biblical devotion designed to fit seamlessly into your day and help you draw closer to Jesus Christ. Thanks for tuning in. God bless you. Well, hey there, everybody. It's Sunday. Sunday, Sunday. It's Sunday, October 13th, 2024, here in beautiful downtown Duran, Michigan. Welcome to this episode of Cafe Devo. I'm your host, Pastor Steve Wood, hanging out as I usually do with my pal Bugsy. He's over there in his usual spot, seeing to all the important things he's responsible for. (laughs) I hope your Sunday is going well. Hey, before we get started with today's devotion, we've got a birthday wish we need to send out because one of the ladies of our congregation is celebrating a birthday today. Jessica DeYoung, it's your birthday! All of us here at First Congregational Church love you. We wish you a great day and all together, folks. Happy Happy birthday! Once again today, we turn to Andrew Murray for our devotional thought as we continue our season of prayer here at First Congregational Church. Today's devotion comes from the book 365 Daily Devotions on Prayer, copyright 2008, Barber Publishing. Today's devotion is entitled, Prayers Fellowship. Matthew 6.6, but when you pray, go away by yourself. Shut the door behind you and pray to your father secretly. Then your father, who knows all secrets, will reward you. Of more importance than all your requests is this one thing, the childlike assurance that your heavenly father sees you and that you can meet with him face to face. With his eye on you and yours on him, you are prepared to enjoy a day of fellowship with him. Fellowship is the living exchange, the interchange of giving God your love, your heart, and your life, and receiving from him his love, his life, and his spirit. We were created for fellowship with him. God made us capable of understanding and enjoying Him, entering into His will, and delighting in His presence. The greatest hindrance to fellowship is anything that keeps our heart and mind occupied instead of leading us to God Himself. What a difference it would make in the life of so many believers if everything were subordinate to the one decision to walk with God throughout the day. What an encouragement when we can say, God has taken charge of me. He is with me. I am with him. And I am determined to do his will all day in the strength of his spirit, no matter what may come. Yeah, (laughs) what a change would come into our lives if prayer were at the cornerstone, not only in asking for knowledge of strength, but the giving of our lives for one day into the safekeeping of our ever faithful and always present God. Father, how we thank you for the day that you've given us for Sunday, for the Lord's day, the privilege of worship. We ask you, Lord, to be with us today. We ask you to use us how you see fit and bless us so we can be a blessing. Give us compassion and kindness where we lack it and help us to represent you well, O Lord, we pray. In Jesus' name, amen. Well, that's going to do it for us on this Sunday episode of Cafe Devo. Before I go, of course, I want to remind you that First Congregational Church gathers for worship every Sunday, right here at the point of Saginaw and Washtenaw Streets at 10 a.m. We're saving you a seat. Hope you can join us. I'm Pastor Steve Wood signing off for now. God bless you, my friends. I'll see you tomorrow.